Good. And soften your hips. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Good. Perfect. What is going on crack addicts? Welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, I'm gonna be posting a wide variety of chiropractic adjustments from some of your favorite chiropractors, some of the most loved ones and most well-known on YouTube. So that's what you're gonna be seeing in today's video with some new additions also. All of their links will be in the description. That's where you can check them out directly. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button to the channel and make sure you turn on post notifications so you don't miss any content from the channel. Now let's get into it and I'll see you on the next one. Next up, we have Dr. Scott Mitchell and Dr. Matt Delgado. So I'm looking at your leg length here and you told me off camera, Natasha, too, that you felt like things were uneven, right? And your hips? Yes. When we push on the left here, yeah. any sensitivity? Um, there, it, it, I do feel, I feel more that the, this side, the right side, yeah, yeah. um, mm -hmm. it feels more like it's higher. Hip adjustment first. Okay. And then we'll have you bend the top leg and then keep the bottom one straight. Perfect. And then I'm going to cross your arms in the front, just like that. Good. Good. And soften your hips. I gotcha. <laughs> there you go. Oh, good. Perfect. Yep. <laughs> and then face up, please. So that was your sacrum. It's the bone that we sit on. And a lot of times it just stops moving correctly or we see it misaligned because of excessive sitting. So arms here and then that one in the mid back. So my hands are a little cold. Right there. Breath in for me, please. Good. And let it all go. And you feel a little push at the end. <laughs> Man, that one, you're not lying. That's the best crack in town. It's the first bone in the upper back. Good. A little bit there. Oh. There we go. <laughs> All right, long overdue for that one. <laughs> there was a lot of pressure. Good. Perfect. And then. I do want to check the jaw now. We always start with the spine first. The top one, I'll have you sit up facing uh, this way over here, please. Okay. So okay. let's have you just slowly open, please. Okay, so good there, and then close. And smooth, there. And then one more time, let's see if you feel like it's shifting. Yeah, that's good. There's, there's on that one, a little bit of shift down to the left but it's not dramatic or it's okay. not a lot. Are you feeling it right now shifting to the side? Honestly, I catch it when I'm maybe just like talking and sometimes yeah. I can just feel it shift. And remind me, ankle sprains on one side more than the other that you felt or more severe injuries on one side than the other? Um, they've both had their fair share of ankle sprains. Right. Um, I, wouldn't, I, I couldn't tell you off the top of my head which one. Okay. Um, Okay, so let's check them out. Let's have you lie all the way back, Doc. My right, your left. And it starts there, that top bone that's called the talus, and it's just not gliding. So sometimes it'll cause a little bit of tenderness, and even up into here. So this is really common for soccer players to get like pain through this muscle. Good there. You even heard a little noise, sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. And on the outside of the foot, right there. Good, on that one as well, that's the cuboid. And then I'm feeling the arches. So your arches have dropped, there might be a little bit of tenderness underneath, especially on the inside of the foot here. I'm gonna bend the knee, let that fall right there. And then I'm gonna make an adjustment to that bone. Good, one more. So that's something that'll help with the arch to create more of an arch in that foot. And as you walk, you'll probably feel like it's just more lifted up, not so flat through the middle of the foot. So it just stops moving correctly. And that is what we're about to free up right now. Oh. There we 
we go. That's the counteracting the effects of wearing heels. So I'm not gonna tell you not to wear them, but just so you know what it's doing to your foot, and then yeah. <laughs> you know we can help you and <laughs> you have in wearing them. And then it's the same thing here on this one, that big toe really stuck, and then the middle of the foot there. Wow. And then now the feet are moving how they should, so let's have you take a few steps and even see if see how that feels and describe for us the difference of sensation from pre-adjustment and after the adjustment. I would say my big toe, I do feel a lot of pain mm -hmm. sometimes when I walk and I'm not feeling it. Good. Um, Is it mostly on the right foot that you feel it, on the big toe? Yeah. And that's the one that was worse, that was more stuck, so it's coming from the heels, mostly. Up next, we have Dr. Joseph Cipriano. Take a deep breath in and out. One more time. Good, and out. Okay, bring one arm up. Bring the other arm up here for me. Good. And I'm just gonna rotate you like this. For me. Any pain with that? Um, no. Okay, and relax. And then raise the left leg up for me. Any pain with that one? Mm -mm. Okay, and relax. We're gonna bring this shoulder back and we're gonna bring this hip forward. I'm sorry. No, you're good. Perfect. And then let me get you the foot to the other side. And that leg pull, you'll feel release from the ankle, the knee, going up to the hip. And then come on. Deep breath in. And out. <laughs> Thank you. Good, and down. Oh, God. With this, we're going to traction and decompress the spine here. Oh, my God. <laughs> I can't even explain it. <laughs> it it felt really good. It was like like an electrical pulse, like starting from my neck and just like releasing down to like all the way to like the bottom of my spine. Oh my god! Good. <laughs> was that like released like a lot of tension on my neck? Good. Oh my god. A lot better on like my neck mostly. Mm -hmm. Um due to like the bad sitting and like I sleep in the most weird position <laughs> ever. Like it doesn't make sense. Um also like just school wise I'm always slouching, the chair's always hurting my back. And it just like it caused a lot of pain over the years. So I feel a lot better like in my upper like mm -hmm. How's that okay? uh, it feels good. Good. And then forward. Um, I don't feel that like tension anymore. That like pain I was feeling earlier, so mm -hmm. I don't feel that anymore. Good. Which is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> See, not too bad. Because <laughs> yeah. I know, you know, I can tell you're nervous, especially for the first time. Yeah. Ever adjusted. Yeah, I was. I was like very scared. Um, 
Yeah, <laughs> I don't know how to explain. But after now. It feels a lot better. <laughs> yeah. If you made it to the end of the video, guys and girls, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more.